Hi, I'm Alejandro Alva with the New York Daily News, and this is Tech Thursday, where each week we bring you a rundown of the latest news in the tech world. What the f***? WTF is now an entry in the Merriam-Webster Dictionary. As of last week, the unabridged dictionary has more than 1,700 new entries that include words such as clickbait, emoji, meme, and photobomb. The board game Scrabble also updated its dictionary and included the word emoji, along with twerking and sexting. Today's news on creepy robotics is brought to you by Google. Google published a patent to develop internet-connected robotic toys that could sync up and control other smart house appliances. The toys would have integrated cameras, microphones, and speakers, and would also be able to reply and show human-like expressions. These toys echo the idea of the super toy teddy bear from Steven Spielberg's 2001 film Artificial Intelligence. Google did not confirm if this research and development project will eventually turn into a consumer product. Mischief managed. Facebook users can now creepily track friends on Facebook with the new Google Chrome extension called Marauder's Map, inspired by the map in the Harry Potter franchise. The extension gathers location data from Messenger and plots friends' locations on the map. The extension was created by a student developer in Cambridge, Massachusetts to show that Facebook location sharing can be extremely precise and extremely creepy. Cortana is about to duke it out with Siri. Microsoft announced that its smart voice assistant, Cortana, will no longer be exclusive to Windows phones. Beginning in June, the Cortana app will be available on Android and iOS phones. The app will not be able to respond to, hey Cortana, like it does on Windows phones, but it will still be able to set reminders, track flights, and answer in-app questions. If you're a Trekkie, you'll want to see this. The founder of online gaming company NatDragon Websoft, and a self-described Trekkie, built his company's China headquarters in the shape of Star Trek's USS Enterprise Spaceship. The building is six stories high and it's about 850 feet long and 300 feet wide. It took nearly $100 million to complete the project back in October. The USS Enterprise building allegedly also has a life-sized replica of a T-Rex skeleton. That's all the news we have for today. Make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and tune in next week when we bring you the rundown of the latest news in the tech world. Hi, I'm Alejandro Alba with the New York Daily News, and this is Tech Thursday, where each week... What the f***? It's now a word in the Merriam-Webster's dictionary. Today's news on Creeper Rubatic. 